There's a new way of approaching material handling. For more than 20 years, Rhodes has been developing the most innovative and carefully engineered conveyor systems available. The Rhodes systems are so technologically innovative that they currently possess multiple patents, undeniably proving that they have the ability to develop the most creative and advanced systems in the world. The Rhodes tow conveyor is unique among material handling systems. The design is simple, but this simplicity is what allows the system to meet your most complex manufacturing needs. Its design also allows for fast, easy installation on virtually any floor surface. The road system requires little maintenance to keep your line up and running. The chain, track and carts are made of rugged, heavy-duty steel. The line delivers your product to the workstation at a precise time, stops and allows only the necessary time for a task to be completed and moves on to the next workstation. This system will allow you the freedom to manufacture products with different processing times on the same production line at the same time. The Rhodes Tow Conveyor's unique design allows the cart to stop at any point along the line. Because a chain link comes along every two inches, there is no delay of movement when a cart is ready to move down the line. The cart on call system reduces wasted labor by eliminating lag time between products. If necessary, your worker can advance the next product in line or increase process time at their station for a particular product. The Rhodes Tow Conveyor System was designed with your needs in mind. Interfacing with robotic manufacturing, transferring carts to another line running at a different speed, small corner turning radius, all are possible with the Rhodes Tow Conveyor. Patented, economical, the Rhodes Tow Conveyor works like this. Each link is calibrated, specially manufactured link chain that pulls along sturdy tubular steel carts at the exact pace needed for production. The carts have a single pin which fits securely in the horizontal link of the chain. The pins can be engaged and disengaged, stopping the carts along the line. This can be manual or automatic as programmed through the control system. From the accumulation area, each succeeding cart re-engages its pin to advance down the line, rather than relying on the last cart to push the preceding carts forward. Since cards can be easily engaged or disengaged, they may be accumulated or switched to other tracks. This allows for multiple loops within one system. Each horizontal link in the chain is a connection point. This feature allows for the cart to engage with minimum delay. Therefore, the system allows for infinitely variable centers, which permit the cart to be towed in any space configuration. The rounded edges of the chain link provide for a gentle start motion as the pin slips into position and the cart moves away. The entire chain drive is secured in heavy gauge steel tracking. Because the system works along a single three and a quarter by two and a quarter inch track, there is considerably less opportunity for stoppage or damage along the track. Also consider the incredible space savings and freedom of movement along a production floor. The system can be mounted on any kind of flooring, wood, composite, concrete, or it can be installed in the floor allowing for lifts or automatic guidance vehicles to easily pass over the track at any location. The system also has the flexibility to combine on-floor and in-floor tracking to meet your most demanding installation requirements. When it's time to expand your production needs, you can easily add to or modify the road system. The system also can be adapted to move from one floor in a factory to another. The road's heavy-duty drive is extremely easy to service due to its design and installation. The unit attaches to the pit ring, not the pit floor, which allows simple access for maintenance. Unlike other systems, gears within the drive constantly relieve slack in the chain. The chain links actually carry away dirt and debris to a clean-out box. The result is a virtually maintenance-free system, which allows quick installation much faster than traditional material handling system setup. This means much less downtime for you and your operation. One single drive can handle substantial loads. Multiple drives can be added as required. Parallel production lines can even be operated from a single drive. The chain can easily turn in as little as six inches in diameter, which is perfect for inline conveyor applications. 
In operations where 90 degree rotations are needed, the Rhodes Tow Conveyor Carts are exceptional. Through the use of a simple bumper turn, the Lazy Susan top of the cart turns the exact 90 degrees through the movement on the line and is ready for the next process. These Lazy Susan tops can also be equipped to interface with robotics during the production process. Carts have precision rotation control and are lockable on the X, Y, and Z axis, so a process can be within close tolerances. Carts can be easily transferred to other conveyor lines in the system. The pin is raised. Using its front swiveling wheels, the cart is gently pushed over the other moving chain. The pin drops down and is received by the next chain link. Movement continues. Because a link comes along every two inches, there is no delay in movement, minimizing risk of cart collision. Since the Rhodes tow conveyor transfers between lines so easily, it allows for the ability to run separate conveyor loops at different line speeds on the same production system. But there's more to the Rhodes tow conveyor. In most conveyor systems, there's no way to change the amount of process time for the varying products on the same production line. Because the Rhodes system allows for infinitely variable centers, we've developed the concept of Rhodes cart value. The system finds the average amount of time it takes to process a product, then spaces the carts in a way to keep the line moving at its greatest production capacity. Through a programmable flagging or barcode system, process times are set for each individual product carried by the carts. The carts are automatically spaced along the lines so that they arrive at each workstation at a precise time and leave once the task is completed, resulting in no line backup and no wasted labor waiting for the product to arrive at the next station. The cart on call system adds the ability to hold or release a cart from a particular workstation. The operator can advance the next awaiting cart to the station, hold the current cart for a longer processing time, or reduce the line speed by a programmable amount to increase process time without shutting the line down completely. A programmable computer control is designed to warn if the line is departing the desired process time. A pacing light informs the dispatcher how the line is averaging. When the green light is lit, carts are averaging the desired spacing. The amber or red light becomes lit when the cart timing deviates from normal. The warning system then sets a waiting period before the next cart is allowed to enter the system so that the line can once again maintain average cart value. Never before has a conveyor system so greatly impacted productivity and product quality. Flexibility. That's the key word for Rhodes Tow Conveyor. Since the links of our chain are strengthened and specially calibrated, the system is extremely reliable. Production can be continuous. The system is stable. Not only are the heavy-duty carts made of welded tubular steel construction, but all tracking is heavy steel, painted for years of uninterrupted service. Reliability. Consistency. The Rhodes Tow Conveyor. The true beauty of the system is its simplicity. All functional parts are readily available and the requirements for service are minimal. Rhodes Machinery stands behind each of its tow conveyor systems. As simply as the links in a chain, the Rhodes Tow Conveyor has brought a new age to material handling. Simple design, easy installation, low maintenance, improved efficiency and quality on your production line, precision cart movement, flexibility, it works, and it can work for you. Well, I came back to work for Penta in 1988, and one of the first assignments I had was getting ready for a project that they call US-91, which is interfacing a lot of the European product into American-made product and to American-made assembly. And one of the requirements was to automate the assembly line. Well. We have been using a push system, it's a manual system, the people build their engines, work in stations, and they manually push the engine from station to station. I'm an engine dress-up facility, I don't manufacture raw material into finished product, I manufacture finished product into a finished product. All I do is dress engines with parts, paint the engines. 
Their conveyor system probably is very unique and it would be one that would work well into a lot of simple production facilities. Well, we have a fixed position robot, which I can't maneuver. The road system allowed me the freedom of movement of bringing the engine in, rotating the engine 90 degrees in four positions or as many positions as I wanted. To paint the engine to where the robot does paint the engine just what's in front of it and I have better use of the robot, less wear out parts of the robot because of its extended reach. Because the robot isn't designed to reach but so far and that's the way they design the parts in it. So when you do restrict that, you are getting better utilization out of your robot and reducing wear costs. The average weight of the engines is about a thousand pounds when it goes to the finished product side. So you're looking at a heavy item on the carts. The carts road designs for us are probably capable of handling two to three thousand pounds. The breakaway torque required to push the engines has been reduced by about 75 percent. We automated through the paint booth with some accumulators because we had problems of engines going through the oven too fast or not fast enough so now we set up accumulators and we handle that kind of stuff. But we started out with this downdraft spray booth. I don't have to have a pit which means as expansion comes around I can move this spray booth around anywhere I want it to be on the line. The second thing we put in was the conveyor systems. The conveyor system can be built onto and modified very easily. It's like building with an erector set. It's an add-on built-in system that you can add anything you want to or take away fairly easy. Simple modification, simple conveyor design, simple cart design. You don't have to have sophisticated equipment to keep track of accumulators, photostatic eyes, electric eyes, switches, and this kind of stuff. Very simple design cart. And being the one responsible for this operation of this plant, it is nice to know that I do have people I can turn to to help me out in the bind, and they will deliver the product. Simple system, low cost, easy to maintain. There's such a complete group of people that I don't have to shop. Therefore, it's a nice situation to be in that the equipment in the plant belongs to one person. They're responsible, their warranties and their conditions are met. You know, I don't have a problem.